Just wanted to go ahead and make a video showing you guys how I made my silhouette invitations. So this is the first step you would have to do is um, insert the picture that you want to go ahead and get this done. And this particular video is going to be for the silhouette doll. Um, so you're going to go to upload, you're going to select the image. You're going to insert it. And then right here on the bottom, you could zoom out so that way you could see the whole image. And then what you're going to want to do is unlock right here on the bottom. And then you're going to change the sizing to what you would um, like. Um, my particular invitation, I have certain sizing for it. So for the width on it, it's going to be 4.202. And the height, it's 5.602. So I got it to the size that I want. The next step is I'm going to be selecting on the left where it shows shapes and select the square. And now you're going to want to do the same thing, unlock it, change your sizing. Uh, mine's going to be 4.25 for the width and then the height is going to be 5.533 okay so now that you have the sizing that you will like um, you have to overlap it just a little bit so when you fold the card it's to the um, they actually meet and it's perfectly so I chose to put it all the way up to right here. Once you decided where you want to go ahead and have them have it overlap, you're going to select both. And then you're going to go ahead and go where it says align and choose center horizontally to make sure that they're perfectly um, in the center and they were already centered so what you could do is um, you could zoom in again just to see up close and make sure you have what how you want it to meet perfectly I'm gonna change the color on it just so that it could be a little bit brighter than that Okay, so now what you're going to have to do, so make sure you have both of them selected. It will show you like this. And then right here on the bottom right, you're going to select weld. And that's going to attach both of them together. And it makes it one, um, one whole piece. And that's all. You want to have a weld, you go ahead and make it, send it to your mat, make sure your mat's loaded with your preferred um, type of paper that you're going to be using. And you just put it inside the machine and it starts cutting. But that's basically it. That's all I did for my invitations. Here's a picture of the final project. If you have any questions or any tips that you might want to go ahead and Give me, feel free to leave a comment below.